This is my first time here. Это первый раз я приехал в Украину. And so you may not be very familiar with me. Мы еще не знаете, кто я такой. And the way God helps me to minister. Вы даже еще не знаете, как Бог действует через меня. I don't jump. Я не прыгаю. I don't run. Я не бегаю. Because when you deal with a problem that has been conquered already. Потому что когда ты двигаешься в власти. A problem that is solved already. All I, to, all, I, all I need to do is to announce to you. That it's done. In a particular country. There's somebody there. A government official. Was put in the prison. In the prison, he became sick. He needed an operation. He was to perform. He was to perform that operation. On a Tuesday. He had two problems. Number one. He problem. A prisoner. A political prisoner. On political prisoner. Number two. A sickness that needed operation. On women balance, na katuro na dabila salvation operation. And one of his students of many years past. He had him is yivo no ushenikov ishios universiteta. Knew about this politician in the hospital. Znal abamne. They caught, they carried him from the prison to the hospital. Yivo ve pusili vturme i vayeni hospital ateli operiro. He was to spend ten years in the prison. Aye mundali desetle vturme. And it was all a lie. No eta bila so fabrikova. He had not done anything. Only she won his dela prabo. But by lie and slander. No, is a sluch of i je avinemi. He was put in the prison. Yivo pasa deli vturme. And then I was called in on Monday. I me ya pasvali. As I got into the room, I saw him lying on the bed. His wife was there. And you could see dejection in the family. And so I asked, What was the problem? He told me about the two problems. Two minutes we finished the prayers. I was then going out of that room. That's the hospital room. Pala, no, I got to the Pala. door. Wanted to open the door. God spoke to me. And then I came back. I said, sir, how many years are you supposed to spend in the prison? He said, ten years. So I said, the Lord said to tell you that this month you are coming out of the prison. You don't, you don't tell a politician that if you are not sure God told you what he told you. So, so I left the, I left the hospital. No, the following, the following day on Tuesday. They wheeled him to the theater. And he evolved theater now operation. Wanted to do the operation. And he can tell you evolve that. And then, as they examined him, no, kada and he tell the past leave me at He was perfectly, completely, hundred percent healed. Nothing to operate. That was number one miracle. At a bila shuda number two. Number two. That very week. They announced nationally over the radio. Ten years imprisonment cancelled. God provides for Abiyevila. So he will be prosecuted. He will not live. He will disappear. There is a solution here. In that country. After I came out of the prison, he became the first chairman of the ruling party of that country. And any time I get to that country, they treat me like you know I'm the kingmaker. I'm talking about manifestation. It's manifestation through kingdom authority. We've been talking about the influence of the kingdom of God. 
on society. Now when you think about society, about society, society originally was just the composite of men and women. Men, women and children. As you come to the New Testament, society became nations. Became cities. Became villages. And you have all of them together. Today, society has changed. It's not just city, nations, or village. If you spell that word society, Yes, there are statesmen. Not talking about society, the society of statesmen. Yes, the society of secularism. Yes, the society of As you look at Europe. Europe, you have secular minded people and as you are thinking about this section of society and that section you think about the secular minded people that's society you have what we call outcasts those are your oppressed people whether you call them outcasts Oppressed people, oppressed people, or women who are kind of battered in their families. Or you are talking about orphans. It's another section of society that we need to develop strategy to know how do we reach there. Now, see that there is a of children. When you think about children from the age of zero to the age of 12. It's a society by itself alone. And you want to know how to reach those children. These countries, the percentage of children will be about 30%. Some countries even have up to 40% children. And if you, when you pick up uh, the population of a particular country, if you read all the information about the country, you will see from 0 to 15, from, from 15 to 65, and then 65 upwards. And the statistics will tell you what percentage of this and this and this you have. And you think in that way, think about society. There's also a search of cultures. From situation to situation, culture to culture, things change. That's why the method that is working in this culture may not work in that culture. society by itself. So as we are thinking about influencing society of the gospel, we are thinking about society as culture. The letter I is telling you about the world of industry. Industrialized countries are very different from uh, what they were many years ago. And if we don't take that into consideration, I mean, I hope that we'll think that we're reaching this and reaching this and reaching that. But that how about the industrialized nations? Industrialized nations. 
the next letter is E. Katom vopshe sve. Have you thought about the entertainment world? Yes, sele mir no razvlekate nava iskuswa, razvlekate nava businessa. You know, sometimes when a pastor stands before you and is preaching, inakda kada pastor sta yuti proper vedue. That's a level. That's a kind of communication of the gospel. Eta on eta ni ploga on proper vedue. The entertainment world. No, guess the ono shet vaiti vrasleka the people who are very deep into entertainment. Musiko idrugi. Are you talking about millions and millions of people all over the world? Proper ved prosta taki ni was miot. There is a kind of approach that is going to reach them as well. Now, see there, there's a world of technology. And then we have societies of traumatized people. And except we look at society, with all these categories, complex now. It just be throwing a general net out that catches nobody misia prosta admin admin method on spasa se options va proper we do talk yet teni ka voni pai mi osh mi pai mai is the youthful society by tom atom vo options for yes che mola dios the kind of music young people love oh which is night mola dios and is lucia ta ki music ka the kind of interaction the kind of way they live and they have a certain kind of shena mu jeni pai atla their outlook and mindset so ka ka is wanted na mi va shea ta sha old view and self esteem he paradigm he he la samo mene va shea ni pai mi osh the youthful generation he va shea mola dios ta so same do go mi That's why, if you find in UK, for example, that was in Velika Britani, the church membership is dying out. Yes, I mean to so for certain Catholics to administer the key. You have some churches in the UK, but but many Catholics are people. And some churches also in Europe. You post here in Europe, eh? That the youngest person in that church will be about 60 years of age. Some in Maladi, Ludi, Serpi, et a dos sit no greatest. We do not know how to connect. So yes, many. I said the new way. With the society of the young people. Destroy it most. It's maladious. So as we're talking about the influence of the gospel. I tell you, ye kaji nam prinisi sas from upshe. The influence of the kingdom of God. Kat nam prinisi ye vangeli. On society. For upshe. We look at all those various areas. Nada ras bit si a sphere upshe. We see. We talk briefly. Make sure you should talk about it. About the authority. Of the kingdom. Ah, uh, vlast you, sas for both of us. Authority is an interesting word. Vlast, it's an interesting word. It's, it's not exactly the same as power. It's a at least shy sound silly. Power is strength. It's a silly that person. It has power is might. It has not just silly. Power is ability. It has some softness. Authority is different. No vlast, it's a shush at least shy. For example, that person still. If I need to carry this by myself, I need power. I need strength. I need some kind of ability to be able to carry this. Authority is different. Authority is delegated power. If I have authority to remove this, I don't use power. Pero dwin ut eta I might be weak to ya mangu bi slabi I might even be kind of mangu sick did bad noy I might be standing up mangu da just ta ya ta me be sitting down mok be sta si de I be even lying on the ground mok da je be lejat but I have authority to to me a vlast a father has authority over the son da pus tin so young do me Papa Imed Vlast not did me. A policeman has authority over a criminal. Police says he Imed Vlast not the no no has authority over the citizens. Yesterday, so Imed Vlast not no shit to lay. Yesterday, the president of a country has authority over the subject. President Imed Vlast not so any grudge than me. A man of authority, Shelovek Vlast, can call the person he has authority over. Moshet Pons Pons Vlast Shelovek not cap cap univo after it no. 
of vlast. If you want to manifest power, sometimes you have to shout. Sometimes you have to stand up. Sometimes you need to bend down. If you are going to manifest power, you must have a good strong backbone. If you are going to manifest authority, you can just stand up or sit down or be lying on the ground. You don't have to shout. Then you call the man you have authority over and say, carry that. That's authority. That's the kind of authority Jesus has. When he sees my eyes, his authority blind eyes be open when he sees a lame man there's no part of authority because that authority has been given to him from heaven he says lame man rise up stand he had now that authority is kingdom authority but yes Vlast, what is that vlast that that authority, authority has not been transferred and given to Men the ministers of God. Vlast sarswa. It has vlast religion nam sishas. In the many places I have gone. In Postemu Miru Kagaya Yesde. I have seen literally all the miracles we read about in the Bible. And I've seen many, many people healed. government officials to lecturers, professors, universities. To medical doctors. To people in America. And to people literally everywhere and it is because of the delegated authority the lord has given if you look at luke chapter 9 and you look at verse 1 it says then he called his 12 disciples together and he gave them power and authority he done in vlast over all devils and to kill diseases. There are three things I'm going to look at very quickly. Understand authority has been given. It's given to every believer. Authority is given to you. Authority is given to Pastor Sunday. Authority is given to me. And that authority makes you to be able to manifest something. You didn't know you could heal the sick, but you can. You didn't know you could cast out devils, but you can. When you have authority, how does authority manifest itself? Three things we're going to look at. Number one, the means of kingdom authority. The mode by which it works. The method by which it is demonstrated. The means of kingdom authority. Number two. The mantle of Christ of kingdom authority. It's a kind of mantle. That you, will know, you recognize that every body around will recognize that Satan will recognize the mantle of authority. Number three will be the ministers that have Christian or kingdom authority. Number one, the means of kingdom authority. If we look at Matthew chapter 8, Matthew chapter 8, reading from verse 5, and when Jesus was entered into Capernaum, that came unto him a centurion, beseeching, pleading, praying with him, and saying, Lord, my servant 
is sick at home. Sick of the palsy and grievously tormented. This was a situation where somebody was sick. I want you to understand this story. The sick man was at home. And Jesus Christ was on this side. And the centurion came to Jesus Christ without bringing the sick man. So there was no physical contact between Jesus Christ and the sick man. You want to understand? Authority manifests itself without necessarily having the physical contact. You think of a policeman. He's wearing his uniform. And then there is a big glory coming. And the policeman wants to stop that glory. There's no physical contact between the policeman and the lorry. Between the policeman and the driver. And the policeman will stand here. And raise up his sign. For the mind for you, Ruku. And look at the man. He is more than And he stands in the middle of the road. On prayer, on the moment, stay a prayer. Man, please, man, are you not afraid? So, I'm sure you buy his stuff. That glory is big. You have to just buy a machine. Or run you over. On the moment, and you are just in the middle of the road. On the moment, for the road, just stay it. He says, I have the uniform that confirms that confers authority on me. Well, as you are dead, very formal. It's a touch to the yacht never last. And he does not need a physical touch with that lorry. Just like that, that lorry will have to stop. So the first thing you learn about the manifestation of kingdom authority is that I don't have to come and touch you. I don't have to need to come and shake you. I don't need to come and lay hands on you. Laying hands is good. It has its place. We are talking about the manifestation of authority. There was a medical doctor in one country. His problem was alcohol. He would have become a medical director in that country. But because of the problem of alcoholism, he couldn't have promotion. He was almost losing his job. And then I went to that country. And the wife came to me pleading and crying. Said, my husband has a problem. It's alcohol. He, he wakes up in the morning. Going to the place of work, Sutra. before he gets there, he catch the day. branches at the bar Snatch is drawn. What is it? Let him come. And, and then he himself. was brought. By the time he came in front of me, he got down pre you could perceive the odor of alcohol. He was, he was drunk. And then I said, in the name of Jesus, I rebuild that alcoholism. You are free. I didn't, have, I didn't have to touch it because I was not manifesting power. I was manifesting what? Authority. Last. And then I said, "You can go." Yes, because I'm you was. And then he went. On usual, he tried to drink. After that, he couldn't drink. On petal supposedly there was soul caras pit on the mock vape. Coming near any bar, it will look as if he was going to vomit. On national told the brat bottle go on national revert. I'm saying, green bottle go Whatever your problem you have, he am gavaru si mona hetu eje flastu. Kaka ya bine bela toya problema. Toya starov e prishlo. Toya shoot e prishlo. I will speak the word of authority. Yes, Simon, your face of you still are. All those problems are over. Your face of you still are. Jesus said in verse seven. Is that your Messiah that is man? I will come and heal him. The Bible says, "Jesus, give me your power to do it." Tell you, Ivo. And the man said, "No, don't come." No, it is shall we give it? No, it is not a tick. If Jesus said he will come to your house and heal your servant, please stop. Yes, but Jesus wants to say, "Yak, to be a damn way pretty." Oh, you say, "Come, come." I want you to. Come to my house. 
the centurion said no I am not worthy that that should has come under my rule said, speak the word only and my servant shall be healed that man understood authority speak the word only speak the word only then he explained why he said that look at verse 9 for I am a man under authority having soldiers under me and I say to this man go and he goes I say to another come and he comes and to my servants do this and he does it what the centurion was saying is centurion silknik saint Century. Century. That means I'm um, a captain over 100 soldiers. Yeah, Nashanik Natsto, Shelovek. Some of those soldiers are taller than me. Nekature is 80 soldiers of any crap. Some of those soldiers are bigger than me. And in Nekature Bo, Shemeya. But my position, no something, I look up as a captain over there. Army, not store, Shelovek. I say to this one, go. I don't hold his hand. And take him there. Vlast you. I make him to move by my word. I say to that one, come. I don't go there to hold him and bring him. I set him in motion by my word. And I tell the other man, do this. And he does it. He says, like I control soldiers. By the word of my mouth. You control sickness by the word of your mouth. You control Satan by the word of your mouth. You control spirits by the word of your mouth. You control, you control mountains by the word of your mouth. You control the sea by the word of your mouth. That is authority. I don't go there to hold them. You need them up. 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 You need You need them You need them up. You need I'm saying the okay. problem. Let, let the sick man stand where he is. Yes, it's about no stand. And then we stand here. It, I ask you, and yes. I point at you over there. That was the yes, I say evil spirit go and yes, it's gone. Yes, that did Jimmy. Very distinguish the duke if you are over. I was in a particular city. That was the me have to go. There's a man that had mental problems. He privily can be some shesh, he was a lover. They changed the hand or chain. Cicatrices, he balanced. And they put padlock. He changed the leg. And he, he was because the man was violent. That's how they carried him to the meeting. He previously even a sobrani. And then I told them. I said, now it's time for manifestation. And then I prayed. I commanded that evil spirit. I said, go away. Immediately, immediately sanity came to that man. Will remove the chain. the chain. And he brought him out. Totally free. And he brought him out. Totally free. And he brought him out. The same thing. He own build bonuses that are even it. physical problems. You buy a problem. Where the student that came from University of Lagos. That was the Lagos, a bill adding student. She had one foot shorter than the other by three inches. It's a day, Oshka. No, not three. No, that's coca. It's a meter of Bolucha. No, it's a centimeter, a millimeter of. And she was wearing special shoe. Special shoe in that one leg. And she was in the audience. And she was in the audience. And she was in the audience. And all I did was to say, in the name of Jesus, short leg, 
grow out. И Бог мне говорит, я, и я говорю, во имя Иисуса Христа, короткие ноги вырастут. Instantaneously. Что вы думаете? That should they grow out to be equal to the other. Нога выросла и стала все ровно. And then she came up bringing the shoe. И она сняла обувь специально. The shoe she was wearing. И говорит, слушай, это я уже не нуждаюсь в этой обуви. And so this man said, I understand authority. Вот сотник об этом и говорит, об этой власти. And Jesus said, Let it be unto you according to your faith. Иисус сказал, если ты так веришь, да будет тебе как ты поверил. Authority is manifested through the word. Власть работает через весь сказанное слово. That's why Joshua said, Son, stand still. Поэтому Иисус навин мог сказал и повелевал солнце, остановись. Joshua did not have to go to the sun to hold it. Иисус навин даже не поднялся, драться с этим солнцем. And that is why uh, Elijah said. <laughs> There be no rain according to my word. Number two. The mantle of kingdom authority. The mantle of kingdom authority. Now about the mantle. You think about Elijah. You think about Elisha. And the first time Elijah went to Elisha. Elijah was Elisha was doing his normal business in the farm. And then Elijah came. Elijah did not speak any word. Elijah took his mantle and threw it over him. Many times we miss what God is trying to say. Elijah did not speak to Elisha. Elijah did not prophesy. He did not say you are going to have the mantle. You are going to be a great man. What God told Elijah about Elisha. Elijah never opened his mouth to tell Elisha. And so he threw the mantle on him. But Elisha got the message. Elisha said, I will follow you. He said, bye bye to my parents. And he came and he followed. And when he was following, Elisha did not perform any miracle. He just pour water on the hand of Elijah. And and no, the mantle had been thrown upon him. No, the mantle had been thrown upon him. No, but he kept on pouring water and pouring water. On the final day, that Elisha, Elijah was to go away. No, Elisha was following. He was saying, "This mantle I will have." Yes, on the day of the judgment, he was quartish. So Elijah said, "Ask me." Ask me. Ask me. What I will do for you before I go away. Let's say, for example, now, I tell Pastor Sunday. I say, Pastor Sunday. Pastor Sunday. Thank you for inviting me. Ask me. What you want me to do for you before I go away? If Pastor Sunday is humble. If Pastor Sunday is merry only. Doesn't want to be proud. Only because she be God. Him. If Pastor Sunday is uh, kind of meek. Yes, if Pastor Sunday crotchy. Oh, Pastor Sunday might say. Oh, more biscuits at. Oh, my father in the Lord. No more at this bogey. I I want to be humble. All I want is a fraction of what you have. And you know how humble we are. Many of us are very, very humble. God is saying, what do you want? Oh Lord, you give me salvation. Whatever else you give me, I will, I'll be all right. I don't want to be proud. You know, sometimes you have to know what it means to be proud and what it means to actually what God wants for you. I believe Pastor Sunday understands humility. But he knows when it comes to anointing. He wants a double anointing. I told you that I've seen many miracles and I say 
There is an anointing, a mantle waiting for you. What kind of anointing do you want? What do you think can be done? Are you asking for a fraction? Are you asking for a little bit? Are you asking for just something small? Or are you going to get a whole portion? And so, Elisha said, give me a double portion. Now, since we began, we have, we have been to 60 countries. If I ask Pastor Sunday, I said, you know, these few years, these few years, yes, we've been to 60 countries. Pastor Sunday, what's your vision? Here is your father Sunday. saying, Whatever you want, I'm going to ask from the Lord to, on your behalf. If we have gone to 60 countries, Pastor, what is 60 times 2? Do I know it? As much as she decided that was to At least for you, yes, sir. You want to say 120. <laughs> At least 120. At least 120. At least. <laughs> the same thing for all of us who are there. You know, you know what I've learned? You know what I've learned? My father who sent me to school. My papa down whose money I studied. Yeah, I became more educated than my father. You know what I've learned? The teacher that taught me mathematics. Eventually. I had more knowledge in math than my teacher. Why don't you put that in the spiritual? That the person who taught you Elijah who taught Elisha that Elisha said he spoke spoke and go beyond the teacher the child can go beyond the father Elisha can go beyond Elijah because of that Elisha said he is a double portion of the and then the chariot came. And took him away. Remember. That mantle had been with Elijah. Since he met Elisha. He was only holding it and keeping it for him. As he was going to heaven. They don't need that mantle in heaven. They don't seek in heaven. They don't cast out devils in heaven. He said, Elisha, I am going. The mantle is here. He dropped it down. Elisha knew that mantle was for him. Do you know that mantle is for you? Do you know there is something here that is yours? Yes, I know yes. Do you know the power to perform miracle? See that for it should the authority to heal the sick. Vlast is the authority to cast out devils. Vlast is the authority to do great wonders. Vlast for it should the sign of It is your and not for your Simonia. Elisha picked it up. He listened for the quartil. He went back to River Jordan. He on Pashok Rika Yodanska. Listen to this. The manifestation of the mantle. Was not one week after. One month after. That same day. When the mantle fell. Elisha put it to test. He brought it by river Jordan. And he said, where is the, where is the God of Elijah? Can I tell you something? River Jordan parted into two. What do I see there? The last miracle of Elijah was the first miracle of Elisha. Elisha 
Suda. The, the last miracle of Elijah. Parting that Jordan. Was a false Yeshuda. The highest. The greatest. The climax. So of the miracle life of Elijah. Ilia was the beginning of the miracle life of Elisha. You don't have to go back and start where we began. Your ministry can begin now. The power can begin now. Your ministry can begin now. We have reached the miracle ministry can begin right there. We have reached the miracle ministry can begin right there. Number three. Not the ministers with kingdom authority. Ministers with kingdom authority. Who are the ministers? Now, we are the ministers today. The men and the women that God has called. Moses manifested that authority. When Moses was in Egypt. He was a criminal. On bills, national bandit. He was a murderer. On bill that you could not have the power of your dawn. He ran away. And then the Lord met him where he was. And he said, Go back to that he same verse. I've seen drug addicts. I've seen criminals. I've seen those who have gone to the prison. I've seen those who are very much in the gutter. I've seen the drunkards. And that's what, what they were before the Lord met them. Now the Lord cleaned them up. Filled them with the Holy Ghost. Filled them with power. When Moses came back, he didn't come back as a criminal. He came back as a man, a man, man with a mantle. And he stood before Pharaoh. He said, "Let my people go." All those people that were criminals before. If all the people that were drunk has before something new has happened you go back to those same places to manifest the power of the Holy Ghost to manifest kingdom authority I, I am no more what I used to be I am no more what I used to be I am no more as weak as I used to be something new has happened in my life and I about Joshua. I about Joshua. Do you know that Joshua was a disciple of Moses? Well, to start with, Moses divided the Red Sea. Moses ras ras to peel shall no more. And Joshua divided River Jordan. Ah, Moses Navin ras to peel Jordan. The disciple will be like his master. This man Joshua, he now went beyond Moses. Jesus Navin so very shall bosh she Moses. You know sometimes I have problem with people. Is that in that day? Every time, Ludi, they'll be coaching people. They say, so and so he was the one that led me to the law 20 years ago this is what he did and once they get to the level of what that man of God did they seal it, they seal it up Joshua, Joshua following after Moses he got to the level Moses got to and now he went beyond Moses Moses never got any Body around the walls of any city. No, Moisei that put him only hadil vakruki yerehone. That was a step ahead of Moses. By Joshua. That will shake it a shag. Katore Moisei ni uvidel no Moisei never never stop the sun. Stop the sun. Moses never stopped the sun. Moisei never never stopped the sun. Moisei that you do it about the Moses never stopped the moon. Moisei Moisei that you never stopped the moon. The sun will go beyond the father. Sin stal bo shatsa. I'm saying the student will go beyond the, the teacher. I'm saying the member will go beyond the minister. And I'm saying that you will go beyond where we have gone. Because this is your day. I said this is your day. This is your day. And then we're thinking about David, the man of authority. 
We're talking about David. Vlasti. And then David had this problem. Et David a it problem. was a national problem. Et David a national look problem. at Goliath. If Goliath and look at his stature. Do you understand? This was not the first time that Israelites saw a giant. In fact, it was giant that stopped Israel from going to the land of Canaan. We saw the giants in the land. We are not able to enter. The giant stopped a whole nation from entering into the land of Canaan. And here comes little David. And David saw the same giant that he they saw. What stopped a whole nation from moving forward would not stop David. Yes, it was a was a product of the nation. David And yet, what stopped the nation could not stop one son in the nation. Now you understand. Before David came on the scene. This was not the first time they'll fight battle. David and his fragile is ranche. They use spear. And his possible is Israeli. They use many weapons. And his possible is Yaki and David, the new generation. David only is not you are not doing everything the way we're doing it. I don't have a spear. Most of us have a rod. I don't have a rod. And if I don't have the rod of Moses, what can I do? Something used the job bone of an ass. I don't have a job bone of an ass. And they did it this way, they did it this way. I don't have what they are. All I have is a sling as a stone. And David said, as a stone. It's not the rod. 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 It's not the and so he said, I come unto you. In the name of the God of Israel. Who you have defied. And he threw the stone. And he brought the giant down. You will bring the giant down. You will bring the giant down. You will bring the giant down. The giants that made the nation afraid. That nobody even was a bitch. Saul had the position. David had the authority. No, who David had the authority. Saul had the title. Who Saul had the authority. David had the authority. No, David had the authority. Maybe the other people outside there. Much of it to give you, Ludy. Sometimes people ask me. In a Daludi, who may scratch you. He said, uh, what's your title? And you want to to say, I am Archbishop Kumui. And when I say, just Pastor Kumui. They say, that's all the title you have. I say, it's not about title, it's about authority. And you want to realize tonight, it's not about position. It's not about title. It is about authority. And when you have, when you have authority, there are people that will come to you. They will say, what are you doing? What do you want to do? I am your senior brother. No, yes, this is to, you know, That's what what Eliab it. told David. If I have not done it, how can you do it? And then David said, What are you saying? Is there not a cause? Yes, Is there not a reason? Yes, Rishina. Why am I in Kiev tonight? Is there not a cause? Is there Is there not a reason? Why are you in the world today? What are you doing here? Why are you there? There is a reason why you are here. Yes, Simonia. Number one. The meals. Yes. Number two. Yes, Sila. The mantle. Yes, mantle. Number three. Yes, the minister. 
I pass it on to you. Three years last. This is your day. This is your time. And this is the moment of the mantle coming upon your life. Tell the Lord I am here. Tell the Lord I am here. The mantle. The mantle. The mantle. The mantle. The mantle. The mantle. The power. The authority. The authority. It's in your mouth already. It's police. It's in your hand already. When you say the word, the word of God. When you cast out the devil, they come out. Bring him out. When you lay hands on the sick, they come out. The word is in your mouth. Authority and power. Authority and power. Authority and power. Authority and power. And power. And power. If you are sick in your body, Slava. the word of authority will Slava. drive it out. If you are afflicted, if you are oppressed, if you are oppressed, that the word of authority is at work right now. Is at work right now. You're not weak anymore. You're not sick anymore. You're not oppressed anymore. And you're not falling anymore. You're not down. He's so much better. He's the Lord. Rise up and take your place. Believe Rise up and take your place. Rise up and take your place. And do what the Lord has called you to do. And be who the Lord has called you to be. This is your day. This is your time. It's time for ministers of the mantle. Ministers of the mantle. Ministers of the mantle. Ministers of the mantle. It is yours. It is yours. That's for you. It is yours. That's for you, star. It is now. Vlast. It is now. Vlast to Tebia. It is now. Vlast to Tebia. In Jesus' name we pray. Jesus. We are going to pray two types of prayer. Me budem sovetsha dve tipe malitve. One is for you to receive your miracle. Perwoj to be tei. The other one is to go out and mean some miracles to other people. And remember, the day Elisha received the mantle, that that day he tested out that mantle. Don't wait for another month. Don't wait for another year. As you receive the mantle tonight, it's it's now and tomorrow and, the, and this coming week, you will go and look for somebody who is sick. Is she you will go and look for somebody who's demonized. Is she a dead Go and look for a real problem. Is she see a problem? And then use the mantle and perform the miracle in the name of the Lord. He probably was same with me, yes, Amen. Amen. Let's be quiet now. The bird see her. Identify any sin in your life, in your body, in your family. After the leash, don't take hostage to bog with the shield seashells. Any sickness, any infirmity, any, any affliction. Bad luck, cause, yoke, anything. On yourself. Or maybe your husband. Or maybe your wife. Or maybe your child. Even if the child is not here tonight. If the child is at home. Or in the hospital. Or your friend. And you say, I want miracle for this person. If the person is there by your side. Proceed. You lay your hand on her. If you are the person that you see, you lay the hand on yourself. If the person you are claiming the miracle for is not here tonight, but just have his name on your mind. It, does, it doesn't matter where he is. Here in Ukraine or here in Europe or here in Africa or somewhere anywhere. Miracle time now. If you are sick, you want prayer. If you are oppressed, you want prayer. If you are afflicted, you want prayer. If you are standing in for somebody, you raise up your hand. 
But the meat is the word of The word of authority. The word of authority. Is going to come right now. And the will come to you. The miracle will come to you. We are ready to pray now. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. I come on behalf of all these people. That problem in the brain, I come right you come out in Jesus' name. That epilepsy, I command you, come out in Jesus' name. I command you, come out in Jesus' name. The impotency in that man there, I command you, be removed in Jesus' name. Impotencia, ya pamelo, ubiriza ime Isusa. All that asthma, I command you, come out in Jesus' name. Asthma, vetam shaloveke, ubiriza ime Isusa. The problem in the ear, the deafness, I command you, be healed in Jesus' name. Gluhate, ya pamelo, ubiriza ime Isusa. The pain inside the bone in the ankle. Be healed in Jesus' name. Oh Lord, I pray. Any form of sickness, cancer or tuberculosis, paralysis or blindness, I trust by the power of God upon your life right now. Be healed in Jesus' name. Oh Lord, I pray that you lay your hand upon everyone. Touch everyone right now. Manifest your power. Deliver all your prayers. So they come to you. Break every yoke. Destroy the works of the devil. Confirm the miracle upon. Just for your vision. Upon everyone tonight. Thank you, Lord, because I know it's done. Thank you, because I know it's done. Thank you, because I know it's done. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 You are healed in Jesus' name. You are delivered in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Now. Amen. Amen. Listen to me. Slow A teacher Ushitel. who knows how to write and cannot teach a student how to write. A teacher is a failure. A minister who knows how to heal the sick and cannot make the other ministers listening to him how to heal the sick that minister is a failure a man of God who has authority to cast out devils and cannot train and teach other ministers to cast out devils. That man of God is a failure. A father. Who knows how to do something. And is not intelligent enough to teach his child. How to, to reproduce himself in the child. That father is a failure. And thank God I am not a failure. Everything I have done. Everything I know how to do. You will do it. Yes, Ivonia. Pere dam vam. Sio na sio ya spasobing. Sio sio bok bjo mne dal. Ya vam shas ve sobo juna vas va ime Isusa. When a teacher teaches a student how to write, kada ushit el ushit shaluwe kupisa. That student will go out. And there will be the first letter you have you write. He understands the teaching. If you never do it, if you never say it, if you never manifest authority, how would you know you have authority? 
a policeman that has uniform. Have you ever put on the uniform? He never goes on the road. He never commands anything. He has authority. You are going to have that authority. And then, when you see somebody who is sick, somebody who has mental problem, you will say, this one will be my first miracle. When you see somebody who is almost dying, this one will be my first miracle. You will do it. I said you will do it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? I said, Are you ready? Father, in the name of Jesus. I'm praying, oh Lord, that authority you have given to every believer. I pass it on to your people in Jesus' name. Receive that authority. Receive that authority. Receive that authority. Receive that authority. And Lord, I pray. As they go out and they see people who are sick, people who are demonized, people who have any problem, I pray that your word in their mouth will carry out your power in Jesus' name. The sick will be healed through you. Your prayers will be delivered through you. Miracles will happen through you. You will move mountains in Jesus. Oh Lord, confirm it on every Gospel, confirm it on every Confirm it on every body. I you because I know it is God. In Jesus' name, I tell you. And everybody said, Christ I fell from the from the bus. I was coming. I was going to work. And since then, I've had I've had problem with my knee. But by the grace of God, I've been pleading the blood. I've been praying. But I had the healing in the name of Jesus yesterday. Десять лет назад у меня была травмирована колено, я упала и травмировала его, и вчера я была исцелена. Слава Господу! У меня такое свидетельство, не хотел выходить, но Господь меня вытолкнул вон с того места. В среду, в среду я ударился тачкой на даче ногу правую. И у меня очень сильно болела нога, и а водители знают, что если нога больная, плохо ехать. Но я... Просто славил здесь Бога, просто стоял и прославлял Бога. И на втором служении, когда пастор э, Сандей молился и Кумуи, Кумуи. Кумуи молился, вы знаете, просто огонь сошел, исцеление получил, я ехал, у меня нога не болела, и сегодня не болит. Да будет Аминь. слава Богу. And so he, he has not even been able to drive because of that. So, but uh, when Pastor Kup, when we were praying, Pastor Kumui mentioned the the problem with the leg. I said there is something like a fire came over him, and under the heat, the pain disappeared, and now he could drive his car to the church today. Добрый день. Болела правая грудь, перестала болеть. Болела поясница, перестала болеть. He said that uh, she had a a situation with her breast. Uh, with the, the right breast and then the, uh, as, with, uh, with a spine and uh, yesterday when they prayed and you know for everybody she discovered that the pain in the breast had disappeared and the pain at the, at the waist also had disappeared so she gives God the glory на сегодняшний день прошел три больницы, академиков, консилиумы, которые утверждали разные диагнозы. Где-то 8 или 9 диагнозов, все под знаком вопроса. И никто не знал, где делать операцию. То ли в позвоночнике, то ли в руке, то, то, то ли в локте, то ли в запястье. И в конечном итоге все эти профессора сдались и говорят, мы не знаем, что. Но после молитвы, вчера была у меня рука пухшая, сейчас она не пухшая и работает.
во имя Иисуса Христа. Аллилуйя. Тебе, Господь, вся слава и хвала. Аминь. И от... И от... You know, spoken on TV uh, in defense of the, of the church and Pastor Sunday. Then overnight, in the New Year night, some hooligan skinhead came and attacked him. They beat him; he almost died, but it became paralyzed in his uh, one side of his body. So they, then he has gone to three hospitals. They have had a committee of uh, doctors and professors, and they said they, could, they couldn't just know where to operate. And for 90 days, he said exactly 90 days this morning that he couldn't. You know, walk with that hand, and the doctors didn't, couldn't help him. They didn't know what to do with it. But yesterday, as his case was mentioned, that he, he that he couldn't believe it, that he, he didn't know anything happened. But this morning, the hand had been, was swollen before and was hanging. But the swollenness had done. Now he could raise it, and he's totally healed. Несколько месяцев назад у меня на позвоночнике в районе поясницы появилось уплотнение такое сильное. Начала болеть поясница, отдавать в ноги, и нельзя было притронуться за то место. Я, конечно, верила, что Бог меня исцелит, но вчера стало чудо, именно вчера сошло, сошло такое, что все пропало, и уплотнение, и боль. Я благодарю Бога, я благодарю пастыря. Yes. She said... She, a few months ago she discovered that she was having a growth in her spine and not just the growth but it was also becoming painful and recently it had started affecting her legs so she couldn't really uh, she had to pull her leg like that but yesterday as they were praying some heat came over her and under that heat she discovered that the legs were loose and she came home checked the growth the growth had disappeared and no pains Вчора, коли пастер Кумої сказав, що щось про зцілення очей, катаракта, я зразу відчула, коли мої очі зціляються, на наче яка тапеляна сходить з очей, приїхала додому, почала читати, писати, я все бачила. І коли глянула на годинник, була 9 година вечора. Єс! Аллилуйя! Слава Богу! Єстаде, ми сказали молоді людей, we told the old people not to go home and stay for their miracle that Pastor Kumi will pray for them. He said after the prayer, I had, had cataract in my eyes, the two eyes. I couldn't read. I couldn't look even at the clock. But <laughs> after the prayer of Pastor Kumi, I came back home, tried to read. I began to read. Look at the clock. I could see it was 9 o'clock or was it what, 9 o'clock in the evening. So I want to say thank God and thank you to Pastor.